Are you ready to transform your summer into an epic splash-tastic adventure? Say goodbye to wasteful, single-use water balloons and hello to the ultimate in reusable, eco-friendly fun with reusable water balloons. Check out the link in the video description to get yours on Amazon today. Princess and made her first public engagement since her recent hospitalization on Friday, July 12th at the Riding for the Disabled Association National Championships. And, 73, is the patron of the RDA, a post that she's held since 1971. The Princess Royal is an accomplished equestrian herself, who was previously on the British eventing. The organization, celebrating its 55th year in 2024, held its annual riding championship at Hartbury University in Hartbury College in Gloucester, England, on Thursday, and met with several participants and RDA staffers before handing out trophies to the winners, and cancelled all of her public engagements earlier this month as she recuperated from a concussion. The princess was hospitalized in June after an incident at her home. The Princess Royal has sustained minor injuries and concussion following an incident on the Gatcombe Park estate yesterday evening. Buckingham Palace shared in a June 24 statement. Her Royal Highness remains in South Mead Hospital, Bristol as a precautionary measure for observation and is expected to make a full and swift recovery, and was discharged from the hospital less than one week later, with husband Sir Tim Lawrence noting she was recovering well. She's doing fine, slow but sure, Lawrence, 69, told reporters late last month. We are both profoundly grateful to the medical team and hospital support staff for their expert care, and to the emergency services who are all so wonderful at the scene. Lawrence continued, We are both deeply touched by all the kind messages we have received from so many people near and far. It means a great deal, and married Lawrence in 1992. She was previously married to Captain Mark Phillips, with whom she shares son Peter, 46, and daughter Zara, 43. The exes opted against giving their children royal titles despite and being the daughter of Queen Elizabeth II and Prince Philip. I think it was probably easier for them, and I think most people would argue that there are downsides to having titles, and recalled of her decision to Vanity Fair in 2020. So I think that was probably the right thing to do. Both Peter and Zara have their career success outside of being a member of the royal family. Zara, much like Anne, is an accomplished equestrian and even competed for Team Great Britain at the 2012 Olympic Games. Her father had been a successful equestrian and won a lot more medals than I, so you do slightly wonder if having two parents who've been in that situation helped and gushed to the outlet of her daughter's riding pursuits. Zara was always a natural and it was really a question of whether she felt that was something she really wanted to do, and she did and she was very thorough and applied herself to it. So she was quite rightly very successful.